let's look at how to stack multiple images together in Affinity Photo in order to reduce the overall noise. Okay, so let's look at this example. I didn't have a tripod with me at the time I was shooting this, so the only way I could get a sharp, usable image was to raise the ISO to get a decent shutter speed. Of course, this has resulted in quite a noisy image. So what I did instead to counteract this was I put my camera into burst mode and you can take a burst of up to 40 or 50 images. Anything beyond that is diminishing returns really. But for this example, I took a burst of 30 images. Okay, and you'll notice there's some movement between the shots. They were shot handheld and that's not a problem either because we can align the images. But what we're going to do is take all of these images into a stack. So we can go to File, New Stack, then choose to add our images here. I'll just select all of them, click Open, and we're going to leave Automatically Align Images enabled since we did shoot them handheld, and then click OK, and Photo will begin the alignment and stacking process. Okay, so here is our stacked document. Let's just move across to the Layers panel so we can examine what's happened here. So Affinity Photo has created for us a new document with a live stack group. If we expand that group, you'll see it comprises all of the images that we gave it in that initial new stack dialog, and they have been converted to pixel layers. So we also have here the operator this is the stacking operator. If we click it, we get a flyout, and we can choose from a variety of different operators. However, for noise reduction, we only really want to be concerned with mean or median. And we're set to median by default. So let's actually just zoom in and have a look at the result. Okay, so this image does still appear to be relatively noisy, but we just need to compare with one of the original images. So to do that, we can Alt or Option click on, for example, a pixel layer here. And here is the noise profile of just one of those images. And to get back to our composite document, all we need to do is just click onto any other layer, or I'll just click on the live stack group, and there is our stacked result. So as you can see, that is significantly improved Essentially what we're doing is we're averaging all of these images and we're increasing the signal to noise ratio. So this is a great little technique for when, for example, you're stuck without a tripod, you can't do a long exposure and you really want to capture something but you have to raise the ISO. Just take a series of shots knowing that you can stack them later in post-production to significantly reduce the overall noise in your final image. And also, I am using median, but I have found that for certain results, especially low light, you might want to try mean. The noise profile just looks slightly smoother as well. So there we go, just a quick video on stacking for noise reduction.